Now, something about cabbage is that after you harvest your cabbage head, you can actually, if you don't uproot it and you leave the root in the ground, this cabbage will start to grow some uh, another cabbage head, um, sometimes even multiple cabbage heads. Now, the, the other cabbage head that it will grow, or cabbage heads, it won't be as big as the first one, but you can actually get another crop out of it. So that's what I'm going to do. I will harvest this one, but I will leave the root in so that this can uh, continue providing me with another cabbage head, even though it would be smaller. Okay, so I'm going to push back on the outer leaves because I want to be very careful. Because like I said, I want to leave this to, you know, give me another crop of cabbage. So I'm going to push back on the leaves so I can sort of expose the stem. And then I'm going to cut at the bottom there, right? All right, so you see that? I'm leaving that root in there. And what's gonna happen is that it's going to grow right here. You wanna get some other cabbage heads coming up here. Okay guys, so let's get an update on this cabbage. So remember we harvested the cabbage, I left it. And you can see now it's starting to form some other heads, so we, I counted four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So that's too much. We don't want it to focus on all of that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take off this one and take off this one and just leave these two to continue to form. Okay. So I'm just going to see if you can see that. I'm just going to break this off. Okay. So I'm removing this one. I'm actually going to cook it. I'll cook it for breakfast this morning. I'll remove this one. And I'm going to remove the... Uh, let's see. I'm going to remove this one. And tilt it down so you can see what I'm doing. There you go. Okay. So we're just going to leave these two to continue to grow. 